Max, we batted down a pass, Darnay had the pick. Um, what, what kind of change in the second half that allowed them? They just kind of went to the ground more and kind of grinded it out a little bit more? Um, yeah, uh, I think we just, we really needed to stay more disciplined uh, between the gaps, the linebackers, just everybody just needed to stay composed and not get ahead of ourselves. And I think uh, we didn't quite get that. You guys have been doing better toward the end of the yeah. season. And then what kind of led to this kind of step back? And um, you know, just kind of a series of events that happened in the game. Uh, tried our hardest, tried uh, disrupting the backfield, but you know, they're a good team, so. How, how disappointing is it because you guys had looked so good in the first half, seven points, and then uh, couldn't quite keep it on? Uh, you know, it's very disappointing, you know, especially when you're heading into the half very confident. And, you know, the score ends up not being in your favor. Uh, so it's extremely disappointing, but, you know, um, just proud of the way the guys fought. And, you know, it's going to be sad when I leave. So, but I just hope for the best with the young, the young guys that are going to step up next year. So. What about that goal line stand? You guys so close there. The was it me or were we out there for a minute before the blue was? <laughs> I'm just yeah. playing. Nah, yeah. but you know, the rest is the rest. They uh, control the game, so there's nothing we could do about it now. Yeah. But you know, I was, you know. We really wanted that stop, and you know, on our side, we thought we did. But, you know, it's just the rest said it was. How do you feel about the future of the program now? Obviously, a lot of changes, a lot of new guys coming in, staff-wise, and everything else. I feel very confident. Uh, you know, kind of the guys that, you know, came under Mora, you know, they're going to start adjusting to you know, Chico. You know, I know they're all going to start adjusting well, and they're all prepared to, you know, following the lead of uh, Chip Kelly, and I'm excited for the future for UCLA. Um, all year long, obviously, so much focus on stopping the run. Can you talk about kind of the frustration to see in the last game of the season and put all those runs up, uh, all, the, all those uh, rushing yards up? Uh, you know, it's, it's kind of really frustrating, uh, you know, kind of going throughout the season, trying to, you know, trying to, you know, stop that talk that's going around for the UCLA defense. But, you know, seeing that happen for the last game, you know, it was frustrating. It was disappointing, but you know, uh, I know I could have done better out there, starting from me. So, how would you characterize your UCLA career? This is the last time you get to put on that jersey. Say that again. So, how would you characterize your UCLA career? This is the last time you get to put on that jersey you're holding there. Uh, you know, it's it's bittersweet. Uh, I'm excited to move on, but at the same time, I'm even a lot of guys that I love and you know grew to love over the past four years. So, you know. It's bittersweet.